Ladies and gentlemen, it's our pleasure to introduce Las Vegas legend, Bob Anderson. I had no TV shows. I certainly wasn't in the movies. I was just a singer without an act. And then one evening in the Hollywood Hills at a party at Merv Griffin's, I think all of Hollywood was there, everything changed. We all stumbled upon the fact that I could mimic just about everybody's favorite singer. Well, that was it. Merv said, we found your act. You're going to be the singing impressionist. You, you got the wrong name. My name is Bob Anderson. <laughs> And I really must admit, he, he, he gets it so close, I, I have to oh. change my act. Oh, yeah. No, see, hey, there were guys doing impressions, but nobody was doing singers, and that was going to be me. I had an act. Murph took me back to Caesar's Palace, reintroduced me to the world as a singing impressionist, and I was off and running. He is the most clever singer impressionist uh, in, La in Las Vegas entertainment history, and I'm just delighted he's here today. Wait till you hear him. While he was rehearsing, I was listening to him in my dressing room, and you're really in for a, a pleasant, pleasant he's surprise. Sensation. The guy is incredible. He's known as the king of singing impressionists because, well, he's just that. Terrific entertainer. You know, yeah. Singer does impressions. Merv Griffin, Mike Douglas, Dinah Shore, <laughs> Rich Little, Jerry Lewis, David Letterman, and the king of late night, could you believe, Johnny Carson. I think you'll be somewhat amazed. He is really super. Would you welcome Bob Anderson? Bob. Man, all that television landed me a two-week contract at the Dunes Hotel that turned into 156 weeks of sold-out performances. I started working with the biggest names in show business, and I really became friends with them all. Well, here it is 30 years later. I'm about a half a mile down the street from where it all started, and I'm still paying tribute to the greatest years of music the world will ever know. I came down this afternoon when Bob was working, and I said, you're going to tear him apart tonight, and he did. Sensational. Thank you, Bob. Would you welcome, ladies and gentlemen, the great talent, Mr. Bob Anderson. Come on out here, Robert. Hey, good afternoon, everybody. Not just once in a lifetime, a man knows a moment. And it's a wonderful moment when fate takes his hand. And this is my moment, my once in a lifetime, where I can enjoy a new and exciting land. Once in a lifetime, I feel like a giant And I soar like an eagle, just as though I had wings And this is my moment, my destiny calls me And though it may be once in my lifetime, I'm gonna do great things Well, good afternoon everybody and uh Thank you for sticking around. Yeah. I'm gonna pay a little tribute to the golden age of music, right? We all know about that. He gave us the best of everything. The people who wrote the songs, the entertainers, wonderful music. And I'm gonna recreate a few of those performers for you right here on the show this afternoon. We got a few minutes to do that. But first, I'm just singing a couple of tunes from this period. 
Once in a lifetime A man knows the moments One wonderful moment When fate takes his hand And this is my moment My once in a lifetime Yeah, where I can enjoy a new and exciting land Now just once in a lifetime I said I feel like a giant I saw like an eagle Just as though I had wings And this is my moment My destiny calls me And though it may be once in my lifetime I am gonna do I said that I'm gonna do I'm gonna do great things. Thank you very much. Thank you, folks. Thank you. Here's a great song that uh, this is the last tune that Frank Sinatra ever sang. In his life, in his real life. He picked a good one. Out of the tree of life, I just picked me a plum. You came along and everything started to hum. And still it's a real good bet. The best is yet to come. Now the best is yet to come, and babe, won't that be fine? You think you've seen the sun, but you ain't seen it shine. Now just wait till the thunder's underway. Wait till our lips have met. And wait till you see that sunshine place. You ain't seen nothing yet. The best is yet to come, and babe, won't that be fine? Now the best is yet to come, come the day you're mine. Yeah, come the day you're mine. I am gonna teach you to fly. We only tasted the wine. We're gonna drain the cup dry. Just wait. Till your charms are right for my arms to surround And you think you've flown before But you went and left the ground Now just wait till you're locked in my embrace Wait till I draw you near Wait till you see that sunshine place Ain't nothing like it here best is yet to come and may won't that be fine now the best is yet to come come the day you're mine come the day you're mine come the day that you're mine oh, baby come the day you're mine and you're gonna be mine